To call Ottumwa softball a tradition is a bit of an understatement. 27 trips to the state tournament, a fourth or better finish in now 15 of them, along with two state titles. By the end of the week, we could even make that three. I'm just ex excited that we made uh, top four and now we just want to win a championship. Last night in Fort Dodge, the Bulldogs played Cedar Rapids Jefferson for the third time this season and topped them for the third time this season. Both teams knew what to expect out of one another, and Coach Frank Houston made adjustments. Normal leadoff hitter Sammy Garrett moved to third in the lineup, while power hitter Katie Sammons led off. I noticed you changed up the lineup just a little bit with having Sammons lead off. I mean, I know they walked the first time you guys played them at home this year. Yeah. Does, that, does that have something to do with it? It sure did. Uh, we wanted them to try to force him in the pitching to her rather than just walking her. The nation's second most winningest softball coach got the best out of his lineup last night, starting in the top of the third with a solid base hit from Cassidy Henderson. I was really relieved when Cassidy got a base hit, but um, we've been able to rely on her for that a lot in the postseason, so I'm really proud of her. Chloe Davis came in to run for Henderson after stealing two bases. Katie Sammons hit her in with a long base hit for the first score of the night. Sammons also eventually scored off cleanup hitter Alexis Wynn's double. We got dreams of winning the state championship and the, you know, the pressure's on everybody up here on the first game and especially when you get in such a tight game, you know, wow, two to nothing and uh, our pitching and our defense was superb. The worst the Bulldogs could finish now is fourth. They'll play Johnston on Thursday at 7.30. Win or lose, they'll play again on Friday. And also on Friday, Coach Frank Houston will be receiving the Golden Plaque of Distinction Award, an award that is given to an Iowa high school coach who has demonstrated a successful career while making notable contributions towards school, community, and the coaching profession. This is the first time a softball coach has received this award. So this is kind of a big week for Ottumwa High School and the community. More state news, switching to baseball, Van Buren has earned their first ever state tournament berth by defeating Preston 5-0 last night. A great performance on the mound from Thomas Fitzsimmons, who threw a one-hit shutout. They'll play at Principal Park in the first round of the tournament on Saturday against Don Bosco. First pitch is at 8 o'clock. Another area school representing at state is Albia. Albia heads to Des Moines also after defeating Mediapolis 4-1. They won't play until Monday at 6 against North Polk.